Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all of the school supplies, the stationery, and all of the fun extras that I picked up for my four kiddos to go back to school. And make sure to stay tuned because I have a couple of giveaways as well. Now, over the years on this channel, I've shared lots of different back to school hauls. But now that the kids are older, the types of school supplies they need have definitely changed. Back in 2020, when the schools were closed, we put together a homeschool room that was a lot of fun and really colorful. And then in 2021, I went a little overboard with the amount of school supplies that I bought. 30,000. This year though, things are going to be different. While we were shopping, we really tried to stick to our supply list with just a few fun extras. This year, the kids are going to be hybrid homeschooling with some independent study while we're traveling. We're hoping that this is going to be the year of field trips for us. For backpacks this year, we decided to go with these ones because they're also going to make awesome carry-on bags for the kids. And then as far as lunch boxes and lunch supplies go, we already have quite a lot to choose from. And you guys, if this is your first time here and you are looking for school lunch ideas, definitely check out the rest of my channel because I've shared over a thousand different lunch ideas over the years. Now, normally when we do back to school shopping, a majority of our supplies come from Target, but not this year. The options near us went extremely fast and there really wasn't a lot to choose from. So instead, we ended up ordering a lot of these things from Amazon and I will have everything linked in my Amazon store if you guys wanna check them out. Now, Mackenzie loves a cottage core sort of vibe. She loves earth tones and lots of plants. So for her, I picked up this adorable new desk mat. Mackenzie loves beige and brown and pastel, so I know she's going to love this one. And you guys, look how cute. There's a little bakery, a flower shop, and a cafe. Next, I have two options for her keyboard. Here is choice number one. I love these really cool hexagon shaped keys. And then for choice number two, this keyboard is definitely a milk tea color. You guys, let me know in the comments down below which one do you think matches better with the desk mat. Instead of a pencil cup, I found Mackenzie this really cool planter instead.
Next, her binder and notebooks. Now, just for fun, I'm also going to include one or two new fidget toys for each kid. These days, Jackson is a huge fan of Stranger Things, and he also loves retro tech. I was able to find him a Stranger Things themed desk mat, and this one is a mouse pad as well. Now, Jackson recently bought himself this new keyboard, and he really likes it, it works really well, so he doesn't need a new keyboard. Instead, I let him pick out these new keycaps. This is a really easy way to give a custom look to your keyboard. Next, I couldn't decide which pencil holder to get, so I got them both. This little arcade game is so fun. I love the Stranger Things design. You do have to build it though, it comes flat. And then he's also getting this retro tape style pencil holder. And then with all of Jackson's extra pencils and pens, he can store these in his pencil pouch. Now, I thought the quote on here was pretty clever, but Jackson didn't quite get the joke. This year, Jackson needed one big folder, so he picked out this Trapper Keeper. Now, I totally had a Trapper Keeper when I was his age, so I'm happy to see that these are back in the store. And lastly, a couple of new fidgets.
Now Lily Style is all kawaii meets gamer girl and she loves all things purple and cats. Now for her desk pad, she picked out this cat themed game controller. This one is super big and it came with a really cute wrist pad that's also super cushy. And then you guys, she picked out the cutest cat themed keyboard. It is so adorable. And check out this matching cat themed mouse. This year, Lily asked for a smaller desk organizer, so we're gonna go with this one. For Lily's binder, she picked out the Purple Trapper Keeper. And then finally for her fidget, I ordered her this Hello Kitty Pusheen Squishy. And you guys, this one smells like a cupcake.
And last but not least, for Griffin, you guessed it, we're going with a Gryffindor and Harry Potter theme. Now since Griffin is only in first grade, he doesn't really need a ton of supplies, but I didn't want him to feel left out, so I did go ahead and get him a desk protector as well. And then if he wants to use a keyboard, I'm just gonna let him borrow my old white one. And to go along with it, I did pick out an extra mouse, and this one is really simple to use. For Griffin's pencil cup, we're gonna be using this Harry Potter cauldron. This is so cute, and it holds the perfect amount of pencils, pens, and scissors. And finally, a couple of Harry Potter fidgets. Now that brings me to the giveaways. You can enter to win one or all of these, and the link to enter will be in the description box below. First, we have a Harry Potter planner set. Next is the purple unicorn bento. I'm also giving away another Stranger Things pencil cup. And lastly, I'm giving away two of these Poppet pencil pouches. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.